He lets the 0-2 fly and has a quick strikeout to open his day. That didn't take long. Fastball. Wow, he's feeling good with the heater. By Peterson away and by Muncie right down the middle. Falling behind three and one to Adam Eaton. Oops. That'll be strike two, and Adam Eaton's going to have to stop and come back and get the bat. He went halfway to first, too. I would phrase that being in the upper portion of the strike zone. Very, very upper portion. Bueller to Eaton with a 3 2, and he gets him swinging. Eaton is really hot, and getting into it with a home plate umpire, Jeremy Rehack. And still a word or two, and Adam Eaton has been tossed from the game. Huh. There was a reason why I Googled Jeremy Rehack today and saw all the ejections. We're here in the bottom of the first, and he's thrown somebody out already. Just told you he has a short fuse. Now Davey's gone. This guy lives to throw people out of games. And now Davey's kicking some dirt at that left hand hitter's batter's box. And Honora's screening Davey from getting at Reha. Davey, as he was walking down the dugout steps, flipped his lineup card up in the air to the bench coach, Chip Hale. Yeah, that's as animated as we've seen Davey. Arano Parra will lead off for the Nationals here in the bottom of the fifth inning. And so the baby shark plays. Tapper left side, nobody home. Infield hit, Gerardo Parra. That's the smallest of shark bites. Leadoff man aboard, Dozier next. Dozier, a deep fly ball, right center. See you later. And his 15th of the year puts the Nats on top. <laughs> That's a good swing, and that's a ball slicing away from Bellinger. It's fair in the corner. Robles speeding into second. He's going to keep on going with two outs. Safe. They had a shot at him, but the ball is just a little up the line for Muncie. It had been there in time, but it's a little wide. Now Anthony Rendon has a chance to extend the lead. The 2 1 pitch. Swing and a ground ball right side and through against the over shift up base hit in the right center field. Robles across the plate with a third run of the inning as Anthony Rendon comes through. He's trying to put away Peterson on three and two. Here it is. And he's in there. Strike three called curveball. Peterson dropped the bat, was headed toward first. He'll have to take the U turn and he's looking up toward the sky. The 2 2. Strike three called inside corner fastball 96 back to back strikeouts looking to begin the top of the sixth inning fastball strike three called Strasburg fans the side looking and now Turner having a word with the home plate umpire and Dave Roberts the Dodgers skipper is going to come out to get in between nobody tossed yet Bueller's 3 2 is just inside ball four. And the Dodgers, who were very upset with the three called third strikes in the last inning. Oh, Bueller's chirping. Now the mask is off, and Rehack's walking out to Bueller. Dave Roberts is out of the dugout. Serious count leverage for Dozier here. He'll take it, and the bases are loaded. I think he let that call affect him. The ball four to Gerardo Parr affected him. Well, here's Steven Strasburg. Here's the 1 1. And a swing and a line drive. Base hit right field. Strasburg. Kendrick scores. Parra holds it third. That's his seventh RBI of the year, and he gives himself the insurance run. Now Trey Turner could bust this baby open. Turner, backhand stop, and a throw home right through the catcher from Peterson. Two runs will score. The Nationals lead 6-1. to one. You're not going to get a double play with Turner running, so you just try and get the one out at home. The throw needs to be up, not down there near the plate. And the end of the day for Walker Bueller. Here's the pitch, and it's popped up. Shallow right, long run for Peterson over his shoulder, and he can't make the catch. It's off his glove. Strasburg scores, Turner over to third on a little pop-up into short right field. Nationals lead 7-1, a tough inning defensively for Peterson with a throwing error. And that one, he had to go a long way back trying to make an over-the-shoulder catch with a big glove, and it hit off his glove, and he couldn't get it. Rendon to right his third hit of the day. Third RBI of the day, and the Nats lead 8-1. to one. And after a delay by the right fielder Verdugo, Robles says, I'll just roll on home. Verdugo kind of stood there with the ball, thinking Victor wasn't going anywhere, and he took off. Now 
Juan Soto, the batter of the pitch, swung on, hit in the air to deep left field. Beatty going back. Wait. 